Welcome to the Transera Business Intelligence Console product demonstration. The need to capture information about customer interactions is essential for business success. Yet this information is scattered across systems and vendors inside and outside the company. This leaves contact centers and business analysts with a lot of unanswered questions. So they tediously and manually compile information about customer interactions and business outcomes from a variety of data sources. The Business Intelligence Console collects, aggregates, and organizes business, contact, customer, and agent metrics associated with customer interactions, pulling both service and business data from multiple systems, contact center sites, and vendors. The Business Intelligence Console applies big data techniques to refine the raw data according to the needs of the business and presents the consolidated information in predefined and custom reports as well as visual displays. Users can personalize the Business Intelligence Console with their own personal folders. Users have administrative rights over these folders, which are used to store reports. Personal folders are created by default, and they appear on the user page upon login. The Business Intelligence Console's library window shows all the reports available to users. The system comes with a set of standard reports. Following are a few examples of these reports. The Q Daily Performance Report provides user insight into how various queues are performing hour by hour throughout the day. This report aggregates data from multiple vendors. The user can quickly view ACD metrics with fields such as handled calls and business metrics like conversion rate for different queues. For example, an administrator could use this report to change agent staffing for the queues based on the conversion rate. The queue weekly performance report tells the user how different queues are performing throughout the week. The user can access information about how many calls were handled, the number of agents taking incoming calls, and the conversion rate for each queue. The conversion rate graph gives the user a quick snapshot of the relative performance of different queues for that week. In addition, the graph on the right shows a graphical representation of all information aggregated in the report. Data from multiple vendors, along with business data such as conversion rate, is combined and shown to the user in a single view. The Vendor Revenue Report allows the user to compare vendors. This report shares weekly ACD metrics such as handled calls and abandoned calls, along with business metrics such as revenue generated. This gives the user a complete perspective in terms of vendor performance. In comparison, an ACD metric report may indicate that a particular vendor handled a large call volume, but it may not convey how little revenue resulted from these thousands of handled calls. Another vendor may have handled only a few calls, but generated significantly more revenue. This is an example of the Business Intelligence Console's ability to provide the user with a complete view of the business. The Business Intelligence Console also enables users to create custom reports. The user selects the topic, date range, and data fields against which the report should be run. Additional topics can also be created. The Measures section displays many different fields available to include in the report, ranging from calls handled and converted to net order value. To include a field in the report, the user simply drags and drops the measure into the Columns section of the report. Users may add as many columns as they wish to the report. In addition, users can group information by dragging and dropping the entries in the Fields section to the Groups section of the report. They can organize the information, for example, by product, vendor, or type of answering resource. It's simple to filter the result based on additional conditions imposed by the user. As an example, the user can ask that the result set to be filtered shows results where the number of abandoned calls were in the 50 to 100 range. This allows the user to create subqueries within the result set of an ad hoc report. Users can change the report view by clicking on the chart or crosstab button at the top of the report page. In the chart view, the user can change the information display to a bar, pie, line, or other format. This enables the user to view the report information in the most useful, easy-to-read format. The crosstab view is also very useful. It allows the user to slice and dice information as needed. 
Before saving, users can see report previews with a simple click. While saving reports, users should also save them to their personal folder for easy navigation and convenience. Users can plan ahead by defining report names and scheduling how often the reports should be run. Options include periodically, such as once a day, repeatedly on a calendar day, such as every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, at a given time, such as 9 a.m. Users also define the report format and distribution email list. Transera's Business Intelligence Console gives organizations a holistic view of their customer interactions over time to help them discern patterns and gain insight for continuous improvement. The Business Intelligence Console is a key component of the Transera Adaptive Customer Engagement Product Suite, which helps contact centers put a business focus on managing customer interactions with data-driven decisions. View other Transera videos to learn more about adaptive customer engagement.